Paul Kuzno from Sound of Prana for Breaking Through Your Fears, Day 9. Today I want to keep it short and I want to share something about the power of listening. So I've been paying attention and working on my listening abilities over the past 8 or 12 months and people keep telling me uh, through the way they're speaking, through the actual words that they're using, how they're acting, that I should be listening more. And I feel like I should be paying more attention to my environment. And as I've been refining my ability to do that, I just keep learning. No matter it's when I'm in a social situation, meeting a stranger with a friend at a restaurant, maybe just seeing an animal come by, anything like that, you know. And this weekend, I was with uh, one of my friends and he's a yoga teacher that helped me a lot along the path and we were playing music. I was playing the didgeridoo and he was playing the guitar and then eventually he started singing the mantra Om Mani Padme Om Om Mani Padme Om and as he was chanting the mantra eventually I started playing it with vocals in the didgeridoo and I didn't even realize how I had started doing it until by the end of like when we stopped the song and the mantra, uh, he was surprised and he's like, I think, I think you were saying the mantra when you were playing the did you do? Is that what you were doing? And then I was like, yeah, I guess I was, you know? And it's like, how do you do that? So I, I wasn't exactly sure how I did it, but I decided to just try again and tune into what I had the moment that had just passed. And then suddenly I was playing the mantra again. And then I learned to do uh, the mantra in the vocals with the didgeridoo. And I played for uh, a little while just to make sure that I had gotten the technique. But by being able to listen more than focusing on trying to do something, that's when I actually learned a new technique. So remember the power of listening.